Well, winter weather and COVID-19 still impacting flights nationwide, including at RDU. Mm -hmm. That is where we find CBS 17's Randy Ayala with just how many flights have been affected. It's the problem that won't go away, Randy. Yeah, you know, Bill Liz, I've been here checking arrivals and departures. So far today, more than 30 flights have either uh, been delayed or canceled altogether. And of course, this is coming off of the weekend when nationwide more than 5,000 flights were canceled. But here at RDU, things have been pretty calm. I haven't seen really any long lines, anything like that. I did speak to one guy. He said he made sure to check his flight status constantly before flying in today. And I got a message like three days earlier that. I should be checking my phone to see if it's canceling because I'm heading to Chicago and then the rally. Mm -hmm. So I was like, oh, it's a lot of snowstorms and stuff. So kind of grateful that there wasn't anything at all. Now, Alvarez is stationed at Fort Bragg. He was in Washington visiting family. If you are flying out today, really the best piece of advice I can give you is just make sure you are checking your flight status before getting to the airport. But now reporting live from RDU, Randy Ayala, CBS 17 News. Yeah, some good advice there. Best bet just to check. Be safe. Well, 